So in this question you must compare two points on an LM curve. Now a good starting point is to draw your LM curve. And there's the interest rate, the level of output, our LM curve, which is upward sloping. We choose two points, point A and point B. Now we're going to compare these two points. If you just look at the diagram, you can see at point A, interest rate is interest 1, and we will say the output is output 1. At point B, the level of output is higher, output 2, and the interest rate is higher at interest rate 2. The question is, why is the level of output higher? Why is the interest rate higher if you move from point A to point B? Now, the output level is higher because that's what we assume when we derive the LM curve, that there's an increase in the level of output. The question now is, why is the interest rate higher at point B compared to point A? And for this, you go back and you say, if there's an increase in the level of output and income, there will be an increase in the demand for money. Now, if you go to your financial market model, the money supply, demand for money. So as the level of output increases in the economy, there's an increase in the demand for money, which then leads to an increase in the interest rate. So the increase in the interest rate is the result of the increase in the level of output, which increases the demand for money. So at point B, we have a higher level of output, a higher demand for money and a higher interest rate.